three products from Hawk Makeup that I ordered. This is the banana Revolution banana powder. It's steel packed. I haven't tried it yet. We'll see. Another two palettes that I ordered. This is from again Revolution. This is their new launch actually. Actually last month they launched and that's the time when I got it. It is still sealed. You can see I haven't tried it out. I'm not sure if I'll be able to use all of these colors. Maybe this palette because I can do contour and concealer from this one. And on this palette, I guess I can only use like a peach character. It doesn't have orange one, but yeah. Uh, I don't think I'm going to use this palette. Basically same formula. So I'm going to use the contour palette. And we're going to take off the sticker deep into this dark shade here. Okay, so it's not too dark. I thought it's going to be too dark. I should have gone with a one shade lighter, but it's actually not dark enough for me. It can still give me like a shadow effect because it's darker than my foundation. Sorry, BB cream, but we'll see. It is creamy. You don't have to drag so much. It for my nose, I'm taking another eyeshadow brush. This is from Wet n Wild because I would have like a more control. I'm starting my line from here, not here because I already have long nose. So I'm going to take a Kabuki brush and blend it like I have Beauty Blender. I'm going to take a lightest shade from here with an eyeshadow fluffy brush so I can just slightly lighten my middle part I'm also gonna go on this side because I wear glasses <coughs> so sometimes this part looks dark I'm gonna do my under eyes with this revolution banana baking powder I don't do bake but we're gonna slightly dust it off it does have a cap like this which is good take excess off and slightly gonna go over like this to seal my concealer off i'm also gonna wet i don't like the packaging of this because this is too sh small of a cap i really like the fit me kind of larger cap because then you can put powder in that cap and use it 